So a person under a cause is a person under siege. Welcome to today's DDRX. We are looking at the prescription, say a blessing. And we've been dealing with causes. The anchoring scripture is still Psalm 107, verse 2. So we want to look at whether the man is under a cause, the, such a man is under a siege. Because to be caused is to be surrounded. And whichever direction the person turns, the cause will align. To be besieged is to be surrounded with all supply routes and relief points completely blocked out. So when one is under a siege, one is overwhelmed with negative or bad omen. So a person under a cause is a person under siege. It's like when it rains, it falls from one bad domain, one negativity to the other. In Deuteronomy 28, 52, they shall besiege you at all your gates until all your high and fortified walls in which you trust come down throughout all your land. And they shall besiege you at all your gates throughout all your land, which the Lord your God has given you. So no matter where a person turns and hides, the enemy comes and lays siege. The walls of a city were built for protection to keep the intruders or enemies out. The enemy will come upon the city, surround it and lay siege to it until the inhabitants surrender. So everything a person trusts in for protection will fall under the siege of a cause. Be it education, be it money, be it friends, be it family. It makes no difference as every war will come down under a siege. Now the general overseer of our great church, Daddy Gio, our pastor here at Deboye, shared a story of a rich man that was caused, you know, for his wrongdoing by another person. In fact, it was caused that he would walk on the street of Lagos. No, this man thought because of his numerous cars, his riches, that it was not possible. But when all his material were, were gone, when he lost about almost eight cars and was left with one jalopy, he sought for deliverance from Daddy Gio. Thank God the Lord delivered him. You too should check your life and see in what areas are the enemy laying siege on you. You can seek for deliverance today. Say a blessing.